Oh my God, I'm back. Did you miss me? No, okay. Uh, it's been a while since I've done a video, but I'm back today to do a video for my very favorite vape company, UL. You can probably already tell by the title, unless I did something clickbaity, which has been my MO for a minute. I'm going to fill up my vape today with my flavor cloud kiss and this is not a shameless self promo this is a i need money so i'm gonna promote my stuff promo this is cloud kiss it is a strawberry cake batter flavor get it while you still can because with the way things are going in the government here in america i don't know how long this is going to be available and it is um made by a new company now not a new company but the owners of the company U.S. Vape Co. that made this sold their company without telling me and now it might be different. I don't think the flavor has changed. They were supposed to keep the um, recipe the same, but the bottle, the label art is different. And you're supposed to still be able to use code TIA20 for 20% off, but I don't know if that's working for everyone because I've been getting mixed signals. Some of you guys said it's still working. Some of you guys said it's not. I've tried contacting the company several times. <laughs> so like get it as a novelty if you're gonna get it at all because it it's probably gonna be gone anyways now that that self promo is over let's get into it i saw this by several other vape youtubers before i got it into my hands because you will accidentally sent it to my old address that was when we were in seattle with our son who has had four open heart surgeries and if you don't know anything about that i'm sorry i'm gonna bore you real quick but go check out my life channel that i've been uploading to a lot more i actually did the 12 days of vlogmas because i couldn't fully commit to a full month of vlogmas because mom life and also 14 puppies and if you're like what 14 puppies just go check out my channel I'll leave a link below to it and you'll be able to be caught up but that's like my real life stuff so like don't go watch it if you're just gonna hate watch well you can hate watch but don't like leave hate comments I've got the cocoa Cali burn cocoa I don't know it's a pod <laughs> of course it is because like that's all that's come out this year but in the videos that I've seen of other vape youtubers do it looks pretty cute pretty cute. I did get sent a couple colors. I have the red one here. I'm going to open it in just a tick, but I have three other ones too that I'm going to give away on my Patreon. Patreon.com slash Tia Vapes. Go sign up if you so choose. I'm excited for the new year and new rewards and awesome things. The end of the year is a little lackluster on Patreon because I run out of like all the good stuff because I give away all the good stuff in the beginning of the year. I'm trying to get this video done while my son is napping. That's also my MO. And look at the box. It does not want to open. Okay, here. Oh, oh, that's why. Hi, I'm new and I haven't done this in a long time. Right on top, we have the user's manual with an anti-counterfeit code. Ooh, she's shiny. We also have a warning card here, but look. Ooh, now that is slick for the cocoa. Before I take out the bottom, I'm gonna take out this little box at the bottom of the package and we're gonna check this out because it's it's pretty hefty for this little box like it's got some stuff in it we're gonna find out looks like cartridges and whatnot oh a do not eat packet Ooh, you well is stepping up their game looks like we have a little chain link lanyard a tiny micro usb to usb charge cable and a pod this is not pre-filled, but it does have a coil in it. And there's, I think there's one installed, so we'll, we'll get into that now. Also, when you buy their pod packs, they come like this. So there are, how many pods in here? Two? Two or four. There are four pods. So when you buy the pods separately, and these are F-E-C-R-A-L, which <laughs> beats me, but they're 1.2 ohm. Oh, back to this lovely little guy. I hope the pod can go down farther than that, though. Oh my goodness. I like this and I'm not just saying that because UL is my favorite I mean probably it helps but like UL doesn't come out with ugly stuff UL comes out with cute stuff right at the top it does say UL and you can see the mouthpiece for the pod at the bottom there's a charger and it looks like battery venting holes and on the side there is a viewing window to view the e-liquid level oh no UL why did you do that I don't know if that comes off. Well, that's the space for the lanyard. Let's see if my camera will focus. My like $1,700 camera that is not even what, 
three years old and already sucks. It doesn't want to focus. Um, hello, focus. Hate this camera already. It's really not gonna focus, y'all. Piece of shit. Anyways, on the side it says test for samples, not for sale. Ew, you will, don't do that to me because I, I wanna use this. There are the contacts for the pod and the battery. Let me run down the specs from the booklet so you know it's true because sometimes websites that sell these like third-party websites can be unreliable AF. The material is aluminum alloy, PP, and PCTG, I don't even know. It is 67 millimeters by 43 millimeters by 12 millimeters with a net weight of about 33 grams, two mil capacity in here. So this is TPD compliant for you EU vapors, uh, 11 watts max output and 1.2 ohms. 520 milliamp hour rechargeable built-in battery. Wow, that's not a lot, but these little pods don't hold that much. Compatible with 1.4 ohm Caliburn pods, which have to be purchased separately, and I have a Caliburn, don't I? Yeah, I got it that this year, right? I'm pretty sure. So that's all of that. Draw activated mechanism provides a more convenient vape, refillable pod, cost-effective to use, top filling method quick and convenient the pro focs i used to know what focs stood for flavor optimal no i'm wrong but i think the f stands for flavor i can't remember flavor testing technology from you all gives you an excellent vape experience this is true the chip has multiple circuit protection functions to supply stable safe and reliable performance this is also true simple and stylish appearance with various colors available true all right so we're gonna fill it it's so easy but there is an indicator light we'll find out where it's at and it's a battery light indicator short circuit protection low power indication vaping overtime indication and charging indication with that light and that's it that's all that's in that user's manual so to fill it up you just pull up this mouthpiece or you don't and you oh there we go i had to get my nails under it and you fill in one of the other holes. There's two to choose from. Can't relate. All right, filling it up with the best flavor in the world. The only one you should ever buy, ever. It's mine. Mm, actually, it's been a while. I haven't vaped in a long time because I don't need it like that anymore and I really just vape socially now. Or like when I'm having a drink or when I'm really stressed out, but definitely like nowhere near as much as I used to vape even like six months ago. I'm gonna put this in and it doesn't look like there's a right or wrong way. You can just whatever way you feel like putting it in. So it's, ooh, it clicks in. Girl, that is how you know it is in. But where is the indicator light? It didn't point it out. Like in the user's manual? Oh, there it is juice window right here airflow hole and indicator light they're really teeny tiny i'm not even gonna bother trying to put it up close to the screen because my camera does not focus what a waste of 1700 dollars! and it was 1700 dollars because i got it it's a nice camera or supposed to be and i got it in like a bundle with like all the accessories and bullshit that i never ended up using i'm gonna give this a couple priming no i'm not i am gonna give this a second to wick up because i just filled up the pod and i'm gonna attempt to put this in oh i love this chain why are they so fashionable now i better not tarnish or like turn my skin and has a little little claw clippy Oh my god, you well wants me to vape again. <laughs> I love I I if you watch my channel, you know like I am not she's not about lanyards. But this is a necklace. This is bougie in comparison to like a fabric lanyard and I'm all about it. I think the other company that does lanyards like this is the Me One which I freaking love that one too, but it spits back like a nasty bitch, so we don't use her no more. Ooh, that was quick on the jaw. No pun intended, but kind of. Whoa, why is she so powerful right now? I mean, it does not take much sucking effort to get this to vape. Hm. 
Well, we all liked the Cali Burn anyway. I don't think I saw any like vape review people that didn't like the Cali Burn. And if I missed that, then tell me in the comments below. But with the Cali Burn pods, basically, it's just a different body of the Cali Burn. And I dig this better. <gasps> Ooh, I'm going out tonight with my friends for the first time in a long time. And I'm gonna take this. I, I think I might, I might be that person that wears it. You will, will you pay me more if I go out and wear this and promo your stuff in the real world? I just noticed like with this back, I was gonna say background, this is just a wall. With this wall, it kind of makes the vape cloud disappear. Or can you still see it? Should this be the thumbnail? I just don't think two mils is actually gonna hold me over with um, a night of drinks. What? So basically, if you go back and watch my Cali Burn video, it's gonna be just like this one, only it's shaped differently. And you know what? That's the great thing about the vaping industry is you can find a great vape in almost any shape and size and color that you want. And that's what I love most about it now that I've like found how I like to vape and now that most vapes work pretty good on the market, now it's just all about freaking style, fashion over function at this point. But I've been saying that for a while now. Now if this came in like a rose gold, your girl would be set. The chain would need to be Okay, let me pitch something to you, you will. It needs to be rose gold where the red is, and then the black needs to be gold, and then this needs to also be gold, and then the chain needs to be gold. Ooh, I would love that. And then the cocoa could be sparkly, like glitter. K.O. K.O. the cocoa part. Kind of like the me one glittery Tiffany stars or whatever, rose t stars. Beautiful. Um, that's it for the video. I hope you guys enjoyed. Let me know what you think because I know the cocoa's been out. I'm late to the game, but like, does that surprise anyone? And also thank you to you well for sending me this for the video. Don't stop loving me because you're literally the only vape company that even still keeps in contact with me with how much I don't post anymore. <sighs> Full transparency, guys. Check out my live channel for more content from me. It wouldn't be vaping related at all. Like we don't know her over there. I'm trying to keep it family friendly advertiser friendly content for YouTube. That's it. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, give it a thumbs up. Feel free to subscribe to this channel for more videos. Check the description box below for important links like where to find me outside of YouTube, Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, my second YouTube channel, my Patreon. There's also a coupon code that I already mentioned in this video. If you're actually watching till the very end, like good for you. Why don't you go ahead and leave me a rose emoji in the comments so I know that you stayed till the very end because I think that's really rare nowadays on YouTube, at least for my channel. And one more thing before you go, don't forget to fight for your right to vape. So as always, I'm Tia and thank you so much for watching.